Hello, everybody. I mean, howdy. Howdy, everybody. This is Crash War on 596, and I am joined by... Kuzuvija. Hello. Today, we are going to finish Drop Circle Country. Guys will shoot Hopefully. Your eye out. Hopefully, yeah. And this is the last second UFO challenge. Yep, that's right. Yep. In the last part, we did the last uh, challenge. Did we? Yeah, we did the last challenge, and it's this one is... Is it harder than the other yeah, one? Yeah, it's, or it's not way really? harder. This one's actually quite annoying. And really, like, why really would that fast. be? Because um, there's other ships that like shoot you from getting the cows. Oh shit! Wow, actually, yeah, this is. It's, it's it's really annoying. You have to be quick. Did they do this in that speed run? Did they do? Did anyone do this challenge the IES three speed run? Oh, I that, that's actually like a huge waste of time. Yeah, obviously, I was about to say like it doesn't seem smart to do this. It seems like a very major time waster. I actually quite like this environment though, um, in the background, it's pretty nice, I mean, it'd be cool if you could have, could have explored it, I don't know, they could have, like, I think what they could have done with this game is they could have, if they had more time, they really could have done more, um, like, caverns in this game, like, have, like, sort of underground areas, kind of like what they did in Zephyr, how you have to climb up and down those, you know, yeah. you know what, you know how, you know what I'm saying, like, not caverns, but, like, I don't know, they would have been oh, cool shit, they to have the <laughs> It would have been cool if they had more um, areas you could go to. Like that's what I have to say. Like rather than just like a linear level. Yeah. That was what was so cool about Spire. Uh, one, two, and three. <sighs> mm. Fifth cow. Okay. Hopefully I don't get hit. Look at the cow animation. Yeah. Uh, it's like a dangling. What cow does that? Come on! Come on! Come on! Shit. So what are the controls for this? Uh, um, X is to shoot, and um, B is to go faster, and A is to grab the cow. Shit, I'm oh. going to get hit. Ugh. This challenge is quite a pain. You're so annoying. And the yellow ones look like a bunch of douchebags. Yeah, can, they take, can they take them out of the pan? Like, I mean, not out of the pan, can they take them out of the pen? Um, no, they can't. Oh, good, okay. Okay. Finally, the nerve-wracking challenge is cool. over with. You did it again. Oh, how gripping was that? Oof, on the edge of your seats. Make sure to feed yeah, it's of kind of a tedious task, yeah. Do not... Speedrunning Tips 101, do not do that challenge. Definitely do not. Do the first one, but not the second one. Hey, yeah, J Jesus. J-Dubs. Is that what his name was? Yeah. J-Dubs. Do you want to take a spin oh, in the fuck. Sounds like, like a record sounds like, store. Yeah, or it sounds Thanks like... Again, uh, it you sounds like um, a deep house like or deep house or underground hip hop artist. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine like a? Okay, today we're introducing a new artist, J Dubs. Put your hands up for him. You know, he's like, hey, I'm J Dub. I don't know. I'm still kind sounds of skeptical like on whether they went out on the street and like asked a bunch of people what their names were and like Japan yeah. or something. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what's your name, J Sean? <laughs> The Storm. Now, what was that one? Uh, that movie, uh, uh, Maluya, Delilah. <laughs> Never saw that. There's some creepy names in this game. Like, hey, it's Noel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no one's gonna get that. And like nail polish comes out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's wearing nail polish. Like, uh. Butterflies. Oh, no, there's the, uh, like there's the, um... Oh, yeah, yeah, I saw that now. I finally, I saw that, yeah. I, I, I didn't know you were talking about in the last part when you said it froze, but now like I see the you. the idle animation. Okay, well, not the idle animation. Oh, wow, the life respawned. Yep. Wow. We were talking about that in the previous part, how the lives, um, once you, like, enter an extra area, they actually respawn. So, if you were smart, if you didn't, if you did, have, if you had the GameCube version, it'd be very beneficial to do that if you were low on lives, because it doesn't take 20 minutes to get into each level area, so, yeah. Yeah, these guys look very similar to the ones in Metropolis. Very, very. I think it's almost like they ripped them and then changed them slightly, you know, ps 2 or fight them, so to speak. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so I think we're near the end of the level. Is this, I think this is the end. Yeah, is we have to do two more challenges, though. Yeah, 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 that's right. Oh, what, what challenge is that? 
Um, we have to like shoot down the UFO in the sky hey, with like Spyro, laser beams right and like here. rescue the cows. The doors are jammed. Not these cows I'll right here. Some explosives, but, um, but don't have cows. any matches. My mama always told me that I should never hey, Spyro, I'm glad you're here. Anyway, my doors are open. With light. Okay, and yeah, even the UFO? This. Huh? What? Are you in the UFO or? What do you mean? I'm not in the UFO. I'm, next I'm in, in the next channel. In the next challenge. Like in the next challenge. Um. No, I'm not in the UFO. Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, I have to press Y. Okay. Hey there, dragon. Thanks for helping out this here farm. Good old Farmer Bill. Any what a pioneer. Farmer Bill. Without him. Any time, Farmer Bill. Hey, howdy. <laughs> howdy. 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 Howdy, Farmer Bill. <laughs> Fiona. Hey, okay, that's Fiona. actually a good name. That name of dragon. Yeah, that's a, that's a good name, yeah. I like her name. And this takes you back to the start of the level, does it? Mm -hmm. Not. Or, yeah. I, I think I'm missing a gem. Let me, let me um, check. Uh, let's oh, see. no. They're uh, missing uh, 11 gems and two dragonflies. Okay. Okay, at least you know it's uh, it's actually in the area, like in, in an area where you. Hopefully, it's like one area that you've just completely missed. Yeah. Now, I don't think those enemies will give you any health because. Uh, what's it? I mean, any things so that they respawn, so they're not going to give you any gems, I don't think. Nope. Oh god, I got hit. I'm I'm just gonna go down here and get health. Hopefully, I can find the gems down. Oh, actually, oh. again. Oh, I thought that was a uh, vase, bars, whatever. Thirteen lives. Oh my god, we're on nine lives when you started this. Yeah. Fair play, yeah. Uh, Matt, fair play. Fair play indeed. Fair play to ye. And by ye, I mean the. Oh, office. I got the glitch. Oh, n oh no, what is it? Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Holy oh. shit! <laughs> I told you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's classic. That is absolutely classic. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you're so lucky. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. You just see, you just see everything. It's just like, oh my god. Fail. Okay, there doesn't seem to be any gems over here. So it must be later on. I'm missing some gems. Yeah, I shoot. You have to like shoot these cows with your electric breath twice to get them to move over to um, this farmer guy over here. Is that a challenge? Yep. Oh, very similar to Zephyr. Kind of. Not very, but similar concept. We have to sort of shock the people, shock them to, you know, uh, yeah. get near. I actually do like that animation that you can like sort of sift through the grass. I like that. That's pretty cool. He did that. Yeah, I like that as well. Oh yeah, do you notice if you like charge in the um, leaf decals, like the leaves fly up? Oh yeah, yeah, the leaves, the leaves do fly up. Yeah, they're kind of like in Spyro 3. I think there's some leaves in the first world, but they don't actually. You can't really control them. Like they just move around naturally. But it's cool. That, I, I guess it's cool that they could do that. Like that was the one good thing they should have utilized on the PS2 because it's a much more powerful machine. They could use a lot more um, animations and effects. So you know what I mean? Like that was yeah. another thing they really missed out. Like they could have, you know, for example, Jack and Daxter. There's so many things going on in that game. You know what I mean? Like oh, here's the gem. Okay. Oh, yes. I thought you were missing 11 gems. Oh yeah, I got a gem right in, uh, in between this guy's legs over here. <laughs> oh yeah, I saw the oh, yeah, ass right here. Okay, good job. <clears throat> Thanks for freeing the cows. You think you can go What's his name? Farmer Dougal? Farmer Dean. Dean. Uh, seems like I'm missing a cow, but I'm not. Uh, okay, let's what talk to him again. What did he for? Where did those okay, yup. We'll make a farmer out of you yet. But what happened? Why do you have to talk to him more than once? I had to talk to him twice, I guess, for like dialogue reasons. I'm not really sure. <sighs> Farmer Dean. Farmer Dean. And there we go. Hey, it's Cedric. hey, it'd be pretty cool if they one thing they could have done. You know how like there's different regions of um, uh, uh, what's the word? Like different. Um, you know, like like for example, you know, Beast Makers have got the sort of rustic dragon. Streamweaver's got the sort of um. You know, unorthodox dragons, you know, like that. Yeah. It'd be cool if they had the dragonflies kind of more native to where they live. 
in a way. Like they, it's yeah, like they like, wear Halloween masks in the Slum Wars. Yeah, yeah. Like or like I, I know that they were stolen or whatever, or whatever the story is. But it'd be cool if they, yeah, if they kind of figured out a way of um, actually changing them. Like maybe like when they're taken, you know, they they try to disguise them or they make them feel it that like they're at home so they don't want to fly back to their home. I don't know. Yeah, like there's like and pale pitching. leaves. That's what you're trying to say. And, like you have to like charge deep the dragonfly out or something. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. You know, kind of like with um, uh, well, Ape, Ape Escape Three in particular. There's like many different types of apes. Like there's there's like there's just a lot of different ones that they're wearing. That they're wearing costumes and stuff like that. It'd be cool if they did that with the dragonflies. However, I see why they maybe couldn't uh, one time and two. Uh, you know, they're kind they're dragonflies, they're not monkeys, so they're not really humanoid, so it would make not much sense, but whatever. Yeah. Okay, so oh, yeah, you need the, the one thing that this game lacks, I just thought of right now, is um, egg thieves. Oh yeah, yeah, they you know that wouldn't have been too much to code, really, wouldn't have it? You know, they really should have added egg thieves, yeah. Yeah, like one in each level. Yeah, it would have it would have artificially lengthened the game, so to speak. Which is, I mean, what the game needs. Let's be honest. I mean, there needs to be way more things to do in this game. It's very. Oh, I missed a drag. Oh wait. Oh, he got shot down. Never mind. Okay. Hey, oh yes. Flavi. Fa Flavi. Okay, he said Flavi instead Oh wait, of Flavi. you don't do the end challenge. Oh, I thought you had to do another challenge. That portal took you to another challenge. Okay, fail by me. No, I just had to like like keep those. Uh, yeah, I, uh, see, yeah. I thought this portal here. I thought that was taking you to another. No, another level. I mean, another challenge. Sorry, that's my bad. What it said, I only got like 20 gems. What the hell? Oh yeah, the um, bonus thingy, the um, challenge levels uh, add the gem, uh, the um, gems to the total. All oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Oh good. Oh yeah. That's right. Yeah. All right. Well, that was good. That was uh, that was pre that was actually pretty quick. You didn't really fail at all. So. Yeah. I th I thought I was gonna fail on that um, one challenge. We have to like get those. Uh, uh, things, you know. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I would have. Uh, loading, please wait. Thank you, second loading screen. We're, you're really, really welcome. Yeah, keep appearing. That's fine. Yeah, we we just love having a loading screen there. You know, just really it gives us a bit of a break from the game. Do you know what I mean? Just yeah. you know, give a well-deserved break. Um, I have to say before, I, I think Ratchet might have said in the other part, but I really like the actual world, the home world. Like, it's pretty cool, I guess. Yeah, I like how you have to unlock it with your uh, new refs and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, it's good. It keeps it. But, I mean, it would have been better if they had more worlds, but still, I, I like their effort, I guess. And, the, and oh, yes, next part you're going to. Uh, La Luau. Luau Island, I believe. Right. And now look at that guy's mouth. It kind of looks like money bags. And he's still talking. Oh, you are a retard. Shut the fuck up, Eddie. <laughs> yeah. Um, Seriously? You're not a tourist guide, so be quiet. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna hate doing the next level. Just because oh, um, the gems are like so hard to find. And oh, I know, it's so confusing. Like, it's a beautiful looking level, but I guess you can talk about it. I won't talk about it then if you want to talk about it in the next part, so. Yeah, I guess I will um, see you guys in the next part, I, I guess. See you guys. Goodbye.